The Manta Trust has currently identified over 4,900 individual reef mantas. Now they can be huge, up to 15 feet long and weigh more than a family car. They have the biggest brain to body mass ratio of any fish, making them particularly skilled at problem solving and communicating. They can be playful and curious, exhibiting a remarkable sense of self-awareness. But if the manta population declines, it will impact the entire ecosystem. Niv Froman is leading a study to understand how these majestic creatures breed. Understanding what factors are affecting their ability to reproduce will allow us to put in place maybe uh, conservation measures uh, targeted to reduce those threats and allow the species to thrive. Nev is kind of a manta gynecologist. He's using the world's first contactless underwater handheld ultrasound scanner on pregnant mantas. Mantas are slow breeders, usually giving birth to only a single pup every two to three years. Discovering a baby manta is a cause for real celebration. With manta rays already reproducing very rarely, the added impact that climate change will have can really put populations and the entire species at threat of disappearing from our planet. By using mantas and understanding um, how well the populations are doing, how often they're reproducing, uh, we can then determine how well our reefs are also. Like elephant dung fertilizing the savanna, Mantas fertilize the reef with nutrients they gather from all across the ocean. If the reefs lose their fertilizer, then the entire ecosystem suffers. <laughs> 